And I... I just pinched my eye. <laughs> Ow! Hey guys, what's up? Erin Leanne Shelton here. Um, this is actually my second video and I'm super nervous. Um, not really, but today I'm actually going to be showing you guys like a super quick, um, quick five to ten minute makeup look using a company that I actually work for called Arbon. Um, it's a completely vegan brand. Uh, we were actually found in Switzerland almost 40 years ago, I believe. Um, and basically we just take pride in pure, safe, and beneficial ingredients. Um, everything's vegan, certified mineral oil fee free, not fee. Mineral oil free, chemical free, anything free you can imagine. Um, yeah, so I'm going to use a wipe take off my face because I have sweaty face all day. My friends are currently watching me. Hi friends. Who is hair? Taking space buns to a whole new level. Me. Ow! I just touched my eye! So I'm going to start out with um, the RE9 line. This is the extra restorative cream. It has SPF in it. It's a non-chemical SPF. It's kind of night outside, so I don't really need SPF. But <laughs> I'm so weird. Ew, why am I so weird? <laughs> why am I so weird? Um, RE9 Prep Work Hydrating Cream. So this is actually my favorite product. Reason being, it actually gives anybody that has dry or oily skin, it gives your skin um, kind of like a drink of water. So it's gonna give you like that optimum amount of hydration, but it's a matte finish. So you're not gonna be like sticky, oily, greasy, anything like that. And it's almost gone, so. <laughs> oh, I'm really sad I didn't realize how little of that was left. And I'm a skincare freak, so. I feel like it makes all the difference in the world when you're like applying your makeup to put skincare on. Like, I have friends that literally put makeup on without skincare, and I'm like, what? Great. My friend Abby, welcome. The next video that I will actually be posting will be me putting a full glam look on my friend Abigail. She's never had her makeup done before. That's going to change today. Um, this is the Press Work Soft Focus Veil. So basically what this does is it is it acts like a primer but it's technically not considered a primer. So it's going to have ingredients in it that are really going to help with discoloration, redness, um, pore size, just brightness of the skin, overall glow of the skin, and it can actually be used on all skin types, which is surprising. I've used it on my darkest clients and then I've used it on pale people like me. Um, I'm just gonna go in with a perfecting liquid foundation. Um, I actually don't wear as much foundation as most people do. Like I was talking about in my last video, James Charles says he puts three pumps of foundation on his face. No, that is not happening today. Um, I'm actually mixing the CC cream. So if you don't know what a CC cream is, it's gonna be like a complexion corrector cream. So it's gonna be like a tinted moisturizer, like, I don't wanna say on crack, but on crack? Can I say on crack on YouTube? Yeah. Oh. Okay. As long as you don't show it. What does perfect even mean? Is there even such a thing? Um, yeah, I just kind of do a really thin layer because the CC cream is really going to thin out that liquid foundation, but the foundation is going to give you a little bit of that extra coverage you need. To be totally honest, I, this sounds terrible, but I really like wearing that thing on my face, so I'm a terrible makeup artist. I'm like, don't wear makeup ever! Dun 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 dun! Get a pimple. It is hot in here! Let me just talk about Emma Chamberlain. Together. I love them! Emma Chamberlain and James Charles just love me. I want to be your friends. My favorite video is her Coachella video. It's so funny. She's like just snapchatting herself the whole time like at the end. She's like day three. Um, I think this is empty but don't quote me on it. Um, the Arbonne concealer is the real liquid concealer. This is gold. Imagine like shape tape plus pro long wear from MAC plus all of the concealers in the world that you're, oh, the NARS concealer. It gets really good coverage, but it's like super thin. I actually used to wear this as a foundation. I 
And then I'm gonna go in with, this thing's actually pretty rad. So this is like the dual ended highlighter stick. One side's gonna be like your bronzer, one side's gonna be your highlighter. Loose mineral powder. It actually is a non chemical SPF 15. 15. I was right. <laughs> so, the only thing that I am not going to use, I mean, I guess I could, but the um, highlighter, Arbon needs to, you know what? That's a lie. I have one. It, they, it doesn't exist anymore, but. Like I said in my last video, you'll literally watch me drown my face in makeup setting spray because I think it makes a difference. Some people tell me I'm crazy and I don't care. <laughs> the YOLO. All the YOLOs. This is like almost empty. This is my personal favorita. Flavorita favoritas. So remember how I said this is gonna be like a five minute, like quick look? <laughs> There's a possibility it may or may not be this bad, but who's counting? Excuse me, airplane. I'm filming a video! Um, this is actually from our holiday collection. This is, I'm pretty sure the color bamboo. I would assume so. Does it look like the one that's the most bamboo-ish? My hair choice is brought to you by Abigail Romo. She, I guess I should have said your, I guess I, guess I should have said your whole name on. <laughs> Whatever. So I took bamboo, I think it's bamboo, and java, and I just did bamboo all over my lid, and I'm going back in with java and my crease and my outer corner, just to give myself a little bit of dimension and darkness. Oh my god, Bean Coffee Roaster, sponsor me. Is that what it's called? Sponsor? sponsor? Hashtag sponsor? Mm. Hashtag sponsor. James Charles would be so proud. Last time in my video, I said I was the girl James Charles, and I kind of uh, agree with it because we're both crazy and outgoing, and we sing and we do makeup and we have the same coloring, which is kind of funny. But um, he's funny, and I really want to start saying sister more, just because I think it's cute. What? Singing my makeup routine. These are my eyebrows. Could you imagine me so awkward? Like I am now putting on eyebrow product. <laughs> just like so, I just brushed this brow and then I went to do the other one. So these are the new Arbonne brow pencils, and I like them. I like them. I like them. <laughs> I like. <laughs> I like them because they're super waxy. So they actually double up as almost like um a brow wax. Not like you're waxing your brows, like, but like they're you know. Nobody get it? <laughs> you understand? <laughs> you guys, Abby is the only person in this entire world that understands what I mean when I don't make sense. Swear. Swear. And she's also the only person that I ever show up to and we pretty much 99% of the time have the same outfit on. It's quite odd. Kind of great to know that, like, you know, Jesus was like, hey, let's make an Abby. Kind of lightweight. I'm in the process of going lighter with my hair, so if you've known me at any point in the past 10 years, you've known I've had black hair forever, so that's about to change. So, fun fact. Um, I have a friend who's not very skilled at makeup, and I'm never gonna name drop because that's just rude. But she picked up an eyelash curler once out of my makeup bag like forever ago, we were kids. 
And she legit asked me if this was a torture device. And I was like, yep, you're right. I carry murderous things in my makeup bag. Torture. And I... I just pinched my eye. <laughs> Ow! Are my mascara. This mascara will change your life. I promise you. Look at these look at this bristle. Look at these little teeth. Um, it actually has ingredients in it that are going to help boost your lash growth. Your lash growth. Um, it's going to boost your lash growth. Actually give your lashes some conditioning agents. So it will really help you know, to keep them hydrated so they grow and they're healthy and whatever. But I go on and off lash extensions every five minutes because... Anyways, after my interruption, um, it, I have eyelashes with this mascara, which is great because I usually don't. They're like little baby nubs, and that's really depressing. And so, especially when I wear eyel like fake eyelashes 24-7, it just feels so sad. You're like, wow, this is just not cute. I have, okay, so I have no idea what's going on, but this entire makeup look, I have done backwards. I usually do my brows first, and then my eyes, and then my face, and I don't know what's happening. So, we're just gonna... Ew. Arbonne bronzer. I actually usually use a matte bronzer, but I don't have any left. It died, so... We're gonna use this one. And maybe we'll just be extra glowy. Blush, sunset blush, this is my favorite blush ever out of all of them. Um, I know I said prism was my fave, but I actually talked about this blush in my last video, but it was cropped out. What was that? No, I think that was a motorcycle. Why did I say it like that? Motorcycle. Okay, so. This is the Arbonne Highlighter. It is from the Holiday line a couple years ago. It doesn't exist anymore, but when I tell you it is fabulous, I'm not lying. This is the Planner in Mocha. This is actually one of my favorite liners. So pretty much, for doing makeup as long as I have, I worked for a beauty supply company for, God, four years? This is Willow. For five years and four years, five years, same day. I was there for a bit. Um, <laughs> so I, my first like real makeup job is I worked at a benefit counter, which was cool. I didn't work there long, but whatever. Oh, also this is the finished look. Um, I didn't work there long, but I learned a lot. So many fuzzies. Rat. Um, and I learned a lot. And then after that, I worked at a Planet Beauty for I think four years. I don't remember specifically, but four years. And I learned about probably every makeup, skincare, and hair care brand on the market. Hello. Um, and then I worked for Mac for a couple years, and I loved it. It was fun. I didn't learn as much as I thought I was going to, but I really did enjoy it. And honestly, there are some things in the Arbonne makeup line that are like out of this world. Like their foundation, their primer is like one of the best ever. I actually used it for like an underwater bathing suit shoot for a client. And the girl compared to the girl that used it on MAC was like melt. She, the, that girl was melting and my girl's makeup was like, oh. um, love it. And everything, you know, the company's been around for so long, but they're, you know, they're still trying to innovate and like learn new things. And so I think it's really, really special that we, you know, take pride in all of our ingredients being like vegan and, you know, animal cruelty free. Um, our brushes are obviously animal free and cruelty free. Um, and everything works. I mean, they're still like learning and they're still growing and they're still trying to like make new things like consistently and, you know, make new products and be like, you know, up with the trends. But I think eventually we'll get there. Um, but there are some things that I just can't live without. Like skincare is all that I use. If people are going to ask me what I use on my skin, it's the only thing that I use. Um, makeup settings for a fire. Um, concealers to die for. Foundation is my foundation of choice, actually. And the CC cream is like my go-to every day when I'm just trying to be quick, lazy, whatever. Um, 
And I really think that that's it. I mean, here and there, like, we have so many shadow ranges. I think we have 36 shadows, you know, eight liners, eight lip liners, every lipstick you could imagine. Um, and it's just really cool to know that, like, there's a company out there like Arbonne that, you know, one really caters to those people that are looking for like more natural and healthy ingredients um but also staying like consistent in like the price ranges of other brands and stuff like that i mean most of our products retail for what like a tart or a mac or um i say lauder lancome those kinds of things would retail for so it's just kind of nice to know that like you can and you have the opportunity to have these ingredients that are so clean and so pure and so beneficial but like you're still getting really good makeup products that work well um but honestly i think that's it this was five and I don't know how long this really was. But anyways, this is like the finished look. And it's cool. This is easy. Like, this is what I would wear, like, on a daily basis to just make my eyebrows. Could be darker, but it's fine. Um, but yeah, I mean, if you like what you see, subscribe to my channel. I have all my other stuff is going to be listed down below in the bio. Um, and y'all have a good day. Bye.